Okay, today we're going to talk about the one question that all atheists fear, or at the very least, they really hate to try and answer this question. You know, I've been, I've been uh, debating going back and forth with atheists for uh, just over a year now, and sometimes uh, I feel like catnip, and I feel like they think they're the cat. Um, they see a Christian and they want to pounce on me and play, and uh, just like they do with everybody else. And, and they always pose this question, and the question is, um, give me the evidence that Christianity is true, that Jesus is God, things of that nature. So, I'll, I'll, you know, thinking they're honest, I'm going to go down the evidence, and I'll cite the scientific evidence, the historical evidence, the archaeological evidence, uh, third-party evidence, fulfilled prophetic evidence, statistical probabilities. Um, I'll cite the eyewitness accounts of over 500 people that saw the events, Twenty-five thousand pieces of parchments and documents um, that are original and show that the text has never been altered. Twenty-five thousand pieces of parchments and documents um, that are original and show that the text has never been altered. I mean, I go through mountains and mountains of evidence only to have them say at the end, uh, well, that doesn't really count. That's not really evidence. You still don't have any proof that God exists, and you certainly don't have any proof that Jesus is God. The first time I heard that, it was pretty stunning. Uh, I mean, I was actually stunned into silence. I didn't know what to say to that, because whenever you're speaking with somebody and you show them evidence, um, naturally you think that they're actually going to look at the evidence and find out for, for sure for themselves, like millions and actually billions of other people have done that it actually does exist. But an atheist will just sort of brush it all aside and um, say that it doesn't really count. One day I was so flustered I said, okay, Show me the evidence you have to prove that God does not exist. It was a blank stare. Uh, they don't have evidence that God doesn't exist. None. And the very thing they accuse Christians of having, which is blind faith, turns out is exactly what atheists have. They have no evidence to support their position. They have no evidence to support that God doesn't exist. So they live with a blind faith that God doesn't exist. 